This is a short video from Culligan Water on how to clean your salt tank after the hurricane. If you have debris in your salt tank and your water is too high, you want to take a bucket of some sort or a fish net and put it into the water and try to scoop out as much of the debris as you can. The rest you may have to take out with your hands. Make sure to dump it into a bucket and not on the ground because it'll kill any of the grass that may be down there or plants. Then take it to the road and dump it in a ditch. So after you get all the debris out, you want to go ahead and go to your garden hose. Find the shortest garden hose you have, hook it up and turn it on. You're going to go ahead and you need to purge the air from the garden hose. So as you put it, turn the water on, shove it down the center brine well, and watch for all the air bubbles to get taken out of the hose. Once those air bubbles are gone, turn the water off, disconnect the hose quickly, keeping it low to the ground, and then you're gonna place that hose in a bucket. Put it in the bucket once again so the water drains down. You're going to drain the water down to about the height of a five gallon bucket. So only enough water is in the salt tank to fill a five gallon bucket. Once that's done, remove the hose. And take a bottle of household peroxide and simply dump it into the brine tank, preferably down the brine well. Let that set for a couple hours, and when the system cycles, it'll sanitize the entire system. You can then go to the hardware store, get maybe a garbage can lid, a piece of plywood in a rock, or simply a garbage bag, place over the lid, to keep any other debris out until we can get there. Thank you very much. You can go to our website for further information on cycling the units, resetting the units, and repairing them, them yourself until we can get out there. Thank you.